The Korean Infantry Fighting Vehicle KIFV, was created by Diwoo during the 1980s and was officially adopted by the South Korean Army in 1985. The primary version of this vehicle is referred to as the K-200. With a production exceeding 1,000 units, some KIFs were also exported to Malaysia. The South Korean Army has been gradually replacing these armored vehicles with the more modern K-806 and K-808 wheeled armored personnel carriers. The transition is expected to be completed by 2020. The KIFV shares several similarities with the YPR-765 infantry fighting vehicle developed in the United States, which itself draws inspiration from the M113 armored personnel carrier. Equipped with both a 12.7mm machine gun and a 7.62mm machine gun, the vehicle's weaponry is supplemented by certain KIFV variants fitted with a turret-mounted cannon. The Korean armored vehicle boasts enhanced armor compared to the M113 APC, but its classification leans more towards a well-armored APC rather than a full-fledged IFV. A crew of three operates the KIFV, which can accommodate up to nine troops entering and exiting via the powered ramp located at the rear of the vehicle. Propelled by an unturbocharged man engine generating 280 horsepower, the KIFV maintains its amphibious capabilities despite an increase in weight compared to the M113. An upgraded variant, the K200A1, was introduced in 1994. This version showcased increased armor and a more potent turbocharged engine producing 350 horsepower, ensuring consistent cross-country performance. Beyond the standard model, various specialized vehicles were developed based on the KIFV platform. These included mortar carriers featuring 82 and 120mm mortars, a command vehicle, as well as repair and recovery variants.